Hi there, I'm Stephen Johnson, author of Farsighted, How We Make the Decisions That Matter the Most. And I'm thrilled to be a selection for this season's Next Big Idea Club. Now, if you're like most people, you probably think that you are pretty good at making big life decisions. But I've spent the last few years researching the science and a number of studies of complex decisions and I'm here to tell you that you are not as good as you think you are. Think back to a recent big decision that you made in your life. Did you have a technique or a set of strategies for making that decision? Did you have a decision process? Most people have one technique that they learned often as a kid, which is the pros and cons list. Now, actually, the pros and cons list has been around for couple hundred years now and it hasn't really advanced much. So if you're using a pros and cons list to make a big choice in your life, you're effectively using a tool that is 200, 300 years old. Surely the science has advanced in terms of big decisions since then. That's what I tried to investigate in Farsighted and that's what I'm going to share with you here today. The reason why complex decisions are, are so challenging is that they involve what I call a full spectrum set of variables. A big decision involves a whole range of facets that go across all these different slices of experience. So think about a choice like moving your family from the city to the suburbs. Just think about all the number of variables that you have to keep in your mind in making a choice like that. You're thinking about the education future for your children in the schools in the suburbs. You're thinking about the economic opportunities of maybe buying or renting a place uh, in the city versus the suburbs. You're thinking about the job prospects in a new town. You're thinking about your relationship to nature. There's a whole range of variables that have to be brought into the equation for making a choice like that. And the human brain, sadly, just isn't very good at wrestling with all those variables uh, on its own. It needs hacks, really. It needs tricks to assist it making a decision of that magnitude. That's what Farsighted is all about. In the book, I divide up the decision-making process into three distinct phases. A mapping phase, a predicting phase, and finally, a deciding phase. In this series of videos, I'm gonna walk you through these three stages, offering you some specific tips and strategies for making choices of this magnitude, drawing on insights from behavioral psychology, from neuroscience, and from management theory. Whether you're thinking about a career change, whether you're thinking about moving to a new city, or whether you're thinking about launching a new product, these tools are here to help.